Hello friends and fellow flute enthusiasts. Thanks for tuning in. This is a new series for me called Gear Reviews. I frequently get emails asking about what gear I use ranging from flute stands to flute cases to microphones and cables and PA systems all the way down to settings on my computer. So I'm hoping in this series that we'll cover and address a lot of the frequently asked ones. Uh, we're starting off with a flute stand. Uh, this is one of the most practical pieces of equipment that you'll have, especially if you travel with your flutes or you go to flute circle, uh, etc. So today we're going to be looking at a flute stand made by Glenn Pastella. He's in Wisconsin and he makes these awesome folding flute stands. I've got mine already set up here, so I'm going to go backwards and show you uh, all the way down to what this flute case or what this flute stand comes in this little case. So one of the features right off the bat that I really appreciate about this is the movable pegs. And we'll get to that as we start to take flutes off of this. But I wanna show you one thing in particular and we'll notice this as we uncover more of the flute stand. I have the Pro model. Um, Glenn makes several different models from small to jumbo. Um, I have the Pro model in that it, it, it pivots and it swivels together. Um, but the one thing that I like about this is he's really been thoughtful around how he makes these. And so things like drone flutes no longer have to go on just one peg. They can have something here where on the ends he's made them closer together. So you could put a small flute and a large flute beside each other or something like a drone flute that the barrels are, um, the bores are close together like this, it works really well. So now I'm going to um, start taking off flutes and it'll expose what just the flute stand is. Now I didn't load up this flute stand uh, full of flutes. Um, I could if I wanted to. Um, and depending on if I have a drone flute or not, uh, this flute will, this flute stand will hold 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 flutes. Again, he makes them a little larger, some a little smaller. Here's the best thing that I like about this. We see a lot of flute stands out there and what ends up happening is we get the pegs that are the same size as the hole that they fit into in here. But Glenn has taken this a step further. Now these are all the same uh, as the um, as the hole, but then you get ones like these really big dowels here, but he's made the end of it to be the same size. So here's what I get, even with the smallest one here, and there are four sizes, um, four size pegs here, but they're all the same end. So what I'm able to do then is say how I want to set this up. I dictate that and I'm not bound by a big one has to go here and a little one has to go here. I get to move this around. Again, if I've got a drone flute, small flute, bass flute, whatever the case, I have a peg that will fit that. I love the variety and it works for what I have. Um, and I ended up losing one of these, but I have enough now to, uh, to cover this. Um, so let me show you how this thing folds up. So I've got all of the dowels taken out uh, and what we're left with is this. Now on this model, this thing pivots the base of this and I love the construction and idea behind this because what I'm able to do then is when you turn this and lay it down, it's much more stable than most. It's not going to, even if I put a really tall flute on here, it's not gonna flip over, I feel. So I really love that design. So let's see what this looks like all put in this one case. I just slide this piece. It is sewn into two places, so it's not just one large pouch. It's actually two in one. So I like to put the base in one side and then on the other side, this may be a little loud, And that's it. So there you have it. It's all in one little case. Now Glenn sells these on his website. I'll put a link in the description below um, to that and then to a few on 
um, eBay. He also sells them on eBay, so I'll link over to there if I can find one uh, there that's ready to go. Uh, but if you have any questions about this, I've had this particular model for um, about two years. I love it to death. Um, I don't have a need for another one. It holds 14 flutes. I don't really take more than that to a performance. Um, but if I had to buy a bigger one or if I needed a smaller one, this is the flute stand that I'm going to go for. So I hope this is helpful. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, you can reach Glenn through his website. If you have any questions for me, drop them in the comments below and I'll see you in the next videos. Hi friends, thanks so much for watching this video. If you're interested in growing as a flute player, click below for more information. If you're looking for more videos like this, see the playlist in the corner. Lastly, please consider subscribing so you're notified every time new videos drop. Thanks.